Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. It is Friday, two days before we head home and I thought I'd do a little travel vlog, packing vlog, kind of weekend vlog. So here we are, welcome to the bedroom. It's a bit of a mess, a wee bit of a mess. Um, we're moving home back to Washington in February, which is so exciting. And before we move home, Tom, his job was lovely. Today was his last day, which is crazy and so exciting, but he's celebrating and we have plans to go out for dinner slash probably hear him <laughs> out to a neighborhood in San Diego called North Park. Maybe meet up with some friends, not really sure, but he really likes playing video games and COD. So he's playing COD right now with the boys, which is what you're probably hearing him do right now, which means I have the time to pack and I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm kind of hoping he keeps playing and he says, I don't really feel like going out. Let's just order in and I can just go pick up the pizza and then we can come back and have a really chill night. But that's just me. <laughs> it's his night, obviously we'll do whatever he wants to do. Big step for him. I'm really happy and proud of him for taking one for himself because he does so much for everyone else always. That is just like his go-to is to do things for other people. So I'm really happy that he decided that it was time. He listened to himself and he said, I'm out of here, I wanna go home. Literally. <laughs> well, I have some time. We, I'm running laundry. I am packing. This vlog is gonna be over a couple days. So it might just be me packing, then us leaving on Sunday and then getting to Seattle and all the goods that happen in Washington. Also, ooh, I got my nails done today. Chromy Chrome winter chrome and I did dip on my regular nails. I haven't had short nails in a long time that weren't, these are my natural nails. Um, also you can, so the dog stuff. These are my natural nails and I haven't had paint on my natural nails in a really long time. They look so tiny. <laughs> oh my God, but I love them. They're very fun. I'm like, here, see them when the, the camera's over here. Kind of like, just like a nice snowy neutral situation. So also, I have makeup and my hair done because of going out tonight. So let's, let's also, I brought the baby ring light that's for my computer. So we have better lighting. Mm. Let's time lapse it, baby. Welcome to the vlog. done packing for now I oh you can't even see it I, I have a pair of denim arriving at the house at my parents house because they were just so cute I can't wait to show you oh my god I'll definitely do a haul of all the things that I ordered to my parents house that are that have arrived I've got so hungry <laughs> we're leaving in two days so I can just let this chill don't have to worry about it tomorrow and we're gonna go hopefully out to dinner because I'm hungry we gotta celebrate my man. Guys, <laughs> you know how I said I, I, I'm really hoping that Tom is gonna wanna just stay in? Do I know my husband? Or do I know my husband? He's had a lovely day. He's been, you know, he went out with his, his work pals. They got him a bunch of shots of whiskey. He was drinking beer, playing COD with the boys. He's getting a little snoozy. Got downstairs. I did get dressed. My outfit is very cute. Let me show you. I will say, nice, cozy Lululemon. This is actually Tom's black denim and my Chelsea boots. I got ready, face, hair, and I walked down the stairs and I was like, what do you want to do? And he's like lying down on the couch petting the dog and he's like, I think I want to stay in tonight. <laughs> and I was like, oh. So I just ordered some Mountain Mike's pizza and we're gonna watch the last Harry Potter. All right. <laughs> oh my gosh. We got the chicken club pizza. 
yum. The garlic knot knots or something. I think that's what they're called. And then the cinnamon knot knots. <sighs> We're going in, baby. Good morning. Happy. Oh, look at that reflection. That's so nice. Happy. To, for me, it's Saturday. So happy whatever day it is for you. It's the next day. I just came out here to take a look at the sunrise because it's <laughs> gorgeous. And um, today is a really busy day. It's the weekend, but it's also the weekend before we leave to go or like the day before we leave to go home, which means obviously there's a lot of admin and a lot of packing and a lot of things that need to do. I packed yesterday, but for the KDH On Demand Library, I am adding five classes because I'm not teaching group classes this week or this upcoming week and the week after for the holidays. But I always wanna give you guys members classes to take, new classes to take. So I tend to, when I'm out of town for long periods of time, film extra classes to upload. And during the week is really hard for me to do that just because I teach so much already. So the weekends are usually when I do it. And I have three more classes I need to film, two strength, two strength flow classes and then one restorative stretch class. So we're gonna go do that, walk the dog. And then we have a lot of extra food left over for recipes we didn't make this week. I don't want that to go to waste, so I have to make some Southwestern stuffed peppers to take over to Tom's aunt and uncle's house because we're gonna go do holiday gifts with them. So, and I wanted to just have some extra food there or make that food so we didn't, we had extras. So I have to do that, but. First up, filming class, walking doggy, making peppers. <laughs> See you during it all, I'm sure. I discovered this, there's, okay. Well, there has been a spider hanging out with us in class all week and I don't love it, but don't hate it because they haven't come onto the mat at all but I was just teaching that restorative stretch and turns out there's two and then there's a baby. So, um, they're gonna go. <laughs> Can't do it anymore. I'm not gonna lie. I feel kind of bad that I just did that um, because it was like a little family and it's Christmas, you know? But there was three of them and they were red, so. Mm. <laughs> I'm excited for you guys to take it, but oh my god. <laughs> then just like that. Ooh. Uh finished teaching. Finished. Did I even say that? Finished. Film the last class. What a time. Gonna go walk the doggy and get on with the rest of the chaos of today. See you later. <laughs> Can you hear me over the over the laundry? Probably not. I'm gonna make southwestern stuffed peppers uh, from the dude diet. Oh my god, it's so loud. Okay, we're making from the dude diet. The dude diet and the dude diet dinner time are my two favorite and go-to recipe books by Serena Wolf. She calls it her tagline is clean-ish food for people who like to eat dirty. So it's just like more whole food versions of classic dishes like loaded chicken enchiladas, chopped chicken club salad with honey mustard dressing. Also, you can tell how loved this book is because it's just falling apart. I love it so much. We've used it so much. Okay, this is what we're making. Southwestern stuffed peppers. Let's time lapse it.
welcome back. You're in my childhood bedroom. Welcome to Seattle. You can see all my letters. That was a four-year letter, no big deal in swimming. Uh, my fourth is somewhere. Oh, good to know. Oh my God, so many things. So landed in Seattle about an hour ago. Picked up, got picked up by my parents, and we went to, which I showed you in the last couple of clips, to West Seattle, which is gorgeous. We went to Alki Beach, which is a beach over there, if you're unfamiliar with Seattle. They have a bathhouse on one side, and one of my best friends, Hope, who makes jewelry, was doing a market there. And I went to go see and check it out and say hi to her and support her, and I got these cute earrings. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with them that she made. Aren't they so cute? So springy, but perfect. Also, like, perfect fun, like everyday earring works with my little starfish and then I hope my brother doesn't watch my videos I don't think he does knowing him so I'm going to show you what else I got but I got there's a bunch of other vendors there which is so fun and then there's this girl making pennants very fun like yeah I guess they're just called pennants that you can put up in your room or whatever and I loved them so when we moved back and there was one that I thought would be really cool for the studio but I got my brother this cute little the Pacific Northwest handmade thing for his wall because he lives in Southern California with me well he lives in LA and I want him to you know have a little taste of home and plus homemade local artist love that now we're home and I'm in a shower because I need to get the I need to get the flight off of me and then <sighs> some packages arrived <laughs> while well, I was in California that I sent here and um I think we shall do a little haul don't you think okay I'm gonna shower see you in a sec <laughs> hello well the hair okay <laughs> let me just say one thing about the hair I'm getting it cut tomorrow and hopes professionally washing it so I'm like really trying hard not to wash it so I wet it because it's ugh, so it needed it um, but it wasn't washed, so it's just gonna be greasy and like just hold the moisture for such a long time. So we're gonna keep her up. I ordered some stuff, some for myself and some for holiday gifts. And I don't remember exactly every single thing that was ordered. So let's just figure it out. A game for my family. Okay, ooh, I know what these are. I'm really excited. I saw before I open this, I saw this artist, they came up on my explore page on Instagram and I was like, slay, those are awesome. And then they were like, the collaboration with anthropo anthropology is such a dream come true, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, wait, these are pants. I can buy these pants? So I did. And I think I'm gonna wear them today. They're so cute. Oh my God. <gasps> Look how cute they are. They have strawberries. Oh, these look so comfortable too. Oh my God, definitely a perfect springtime pant, but who wouldn't want to wear strawberries in the winter? <laughs> okay, I have no idea what this is. But I guess I ordered it. Because that, what I just ordered was, oh, right. Um, I need to write thank you notes <laughs> for my gift cards. I need to write thank you notes for all the gifts I got for my birthday and for the holidays. So I ordered some cute new thank you notes from Amazon. I think this is a small business too. So slay. Jeff Avenue. I got a Drift Avenue gift card for my birthday from some friends and I haven't bought something from them in a really long time, but I love them. So I got something that I've been eyeing. Oh yeah, slay. They're like boxy tea, gray tea. Just looks like it'll be really cozy and I'm excited to wear it. Maybe even with these strawberries, just kind of keep, figure it out. Oh, I remember what this is. For my brother's girlfriend, for Hanukkah, she's a Kindle. And I saw this and was like, 
this would be the perfect little gift for Hanukkah slash Christmas. So found it on Etsy. And I hope it fits her Kindle. Her Kindle might be a lot smaller than this. And I should have gotten the small. But it's so cute. It has little sunflowers, or not flowers, daisies on it. And it's handmade. So if she doesn't like it, she can use it for something else. <laughs> and then last but not least, I got myself a sweater that I thought was cute. Did I touch was cute? That's the voice I use when I talk to Bruce. I miss him. Okay. I'm so excited for this. I saw it and I was like, it, okay. I don't know what came over me, but I really wanted a sweater with a hood. If you can't tell, I've been in a spending mood. <laughs> and so I found this on Nordstrom Rack. And it was so cute. Look at that. So cute. Gray. But then look at the back. It has a nice big heart. Just, you know, spreading a little extra love. And I think it's supposed to be cropped, but I got an oversized, so it's just like an oversized vibe. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> what a time. Well, that's, that's the haul. That's everything I ordered to the house. I'm so excited about these pants. So cute. Okay, well, I'm gonna get dressed and go hang with my parents. Hello, it's editing me. Um, I just wanted to clarify some things because I realized as I've been re-watching this before I export it and put it up on YouTube uh, that I don't explain some things. So two things, <laughs> two things, two things. <laughs> One, um, at the beginning of the vlog, I say that we're moving. That was just to say, that's why Tom quit his job. <laughs> so we're moving in February, but we, February, March, our trip home right now is for the holidays. So it's not the move. And then Tom was in the beginning of the vlogs so and we flew here together, but we're from two different parts of the state of Washington. He is from a small town called Sheldon and I'm from Seattle. So he goes home at the beginning of our trips, usually for the holidays, we split it up. So he went home for the holidays or he went home to Shelton for the first week first part of our trip and I came home to Seattle so we can spend our own time with our families see our friends and just not worry about everybody doing all the things together and then he's gonna come up here for the day before Christmas Eve for my friend's birthdays and then we're gonna go back together for Christmas Eve because I'm Jewish my family doesn't really have very many traditions so we'll go home to Shelton for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day and then come back the day after Christmas because we fly out a couple days later so we'll spend a couple days in Seattle and then at home but yeah just wanted to clarify that that's why he's not in the vlogs he will probably be back in them next week and um i know you missed him sweet old tom tom anyway well carry on hello pals what a time welcome back to seattle slash so i don't think i've ever really vlogged here so welcome to seattle i'm so happy to be back home it's so lovely i am on my way to go to my friend hope's house uh, she is the one that you saw in some of the earlier clips. She is at her market for a little while longer and asked that I go take out the dog. So I'm gonna go over there and while I'm there, actually it's perfect. My parents notoriously have really slow Wi-Fi. So every time I try to upload a video, like a class video to the on-demand library, it takes hours and I have to upload all five of the classes that are gonna be live for this week, all the new ones that are coming up for the on-demand library. So I'm gonna go do that, <laughs> go hang in her house, hang with her doggy. We're home, baby. I love the trees and it's definitely stick season. Like all the, all the, all the leaves are gone. Yeah. I want to show you the little secret. No, I live in the background. I'm at Hopi's and you can tell where my love of mushrooms gets love as well. Sweet Hopi. Anyway. <laughs> This is the sweater that I got and I want to show you the, the fit. It's just a nice little, the baggy daddies, baggy dads from Levi's. So cute. And then my trusty, I keep these, I don't know if anybody else does this. If you don't live in the same place you grew up, do you keep clothes at your parents' house <laughs> for when you come to visit? Because that's what these shoes are. I don't take them with me ever because they're kind of, they're just a little smart. But they're just a fun, they're a fun sneaker that I do love. Very cute, very fashionable that I wear when I'm home and that work perfectly with the sweater. A sleigh, if you will. Okay, I'm gonna go get these classes uploaded. 
just me and the girls having a good time we had some good treats oh so curious my parents just went out for a nice little walk i decided to stay home it's cold i'm tired we woke up at like 2 30 this morning or i woke up at 2 30 this morning and i also need days when i since i do exercise so frequently i do need days where i'm like i'm not moving sorry this i need to absolutely <laughs> stay sedentary and i'm just a tired girly today um so that being said my parents went out for a walk i just exchanged or i just gave them their gifts because i gift giving is my love language i love giving gifts so much and i love watching the people i love because i put so much care and energy into when i'm giving somebody i want to be there when they open it and i want to see their face so we just did gifts and it was really fun and cute and i'm excited for all the things that all the activities that were included in some of the gifts this year we have a game that we're going to play later today and then i got my parents outside of some other stuff sculpt which is this pottery at home pottery kit without a kiln like no kiln is needed so that'll be really fun for them to do i'm excited and now i'm just relaxing and i am gonna sign off here baby i'm gonna say peace out <laughs> i'm sorry i hated that i was it's fine anyways um i'm gonna relax and watch some vloggies and maybe oh i brought my book i'm gonna read a little more miss and fury she's getting so close there's about to be a spoiler for miss and fury if you haven't read it yet a quarter miss and fury this will be like 20 seconds she is about to leave tamlin fully and i'm so here for it he gives me so much claustrophobia i at the beginning of this book it's so visceral for me i just can't anyway <laughs> that being said i'm gonna relax probably edit this vlog as well as distract myself with other things and then i'm gonna film a day in my life in seattle tomorrow because it's a shorter i have one class that i'm teaching and then i'm going to get my hair done and just a nice day with my mama well probably both my parents just a nice day at home what a time i hope you're having a lovely 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 wednesday and i shall see you so soon See you on Friday. Bye-bye.